Miley Cyrus. We've got to talk about Miley. She's everywhere right now, right? Has a lewd performance at the VMAs. Everybody's angry and upset with her. Even people who usually like the over-sexualization of young girls are really mad about Miley Cyrus's performance. Now, if this were not Miley Cyrus who actually did this act, nobody would even care because what she did, frankly, was not nearly as bad as a lot of the stuff that is mainstream and your little kids, I'm sure their sweet little angels, are watching this on a daily basis anyway. But because it was Hannah Montana, we have to have some kind of an outrage. You see, South Park called this actually with not one, but two episodes many years ago. One of them was called Stupid Spoiled Whore, where they made fun of the over-sexualization of young girls and, and being uh, just drawn to the, the character of Paris Hilton. Then they did another one where they ritualistically sacrificed Britney Spears after Britney Spears was having her meltdown. At the end of the episode, they flashed a picture of Miley Cyrus and society began the satanic chants as if Cyrus was the next in line to be ritualistically sacrificed. Truth is, society does this to young uh, Pop-Tarts, I guess is what they're called right now, on a regular basis. We did it with Christina Aguilera, we did it with Britney Spears, and now we are doing it with Miley Cyrus. The formula is always the same. They start off as a young star, you expect them to never ever grow up, and then they become adults. And guess what? Adults want to show off some sex appeal occasionally, and then parents freak out. Well, then the pushback comes in, and by the way, the previous criticism of Miley Cyrus on the poll and the Salvia thing was completely unjustified. So now what you have is the same thing you have with Christina Aguilera, the same thing with Britney Spears. Miley's doing the same thing. She didn't do anything wrong and you criticized her, so now she's going to push the limit. And it happens every year at the VMAs, whether it's R. Ke R. Kelly dropping his, his drawers and trying to lure children into his van with little bits of candy, or Miley Cyrus ritualistically slitting the throat of Hannah Montana on the stage on cable television. It's going to happen again, and Miley one day will have a beautiful little song about being beautiful and growing up just like Britney Spears and Christina Aguilera did, and you'll all forget about this, and will have moved on to sacrificing the next little Pop-Tart. But ultimately, it's your fault. You created the monster. I'm Casey Hendrickson. Thank you for watching.